I will be graduating from Penn. I will be taking a gap year before medical school. I grew up in a Christian home and attending church and small group just seemed like a routine and grain pattern in my life and I treated my prayers like a vending machine. But throughout my four years of college, the Lord has faithfully opened my eyes to many sights and truths, and in short, I found God. During my freshman year of college, the Lord humbled me very early on, crushing my pride for my high school achievements. In my freshman fall semester, I remember scoring 10 points lower than average on a midterm, and after class, I called my mom over the phone while crying outside of DRL. My mom comforted me and told me that the Lord will take care of me. However, at that time, I was so blinded by academic achievements for the sake of becoming a doctor that I failed to see why the Lord has called me to become a doctor and the plans he wants me to fulfill as a doctor. The biggest turning point was during my freshman summer when I went on a two-month long missions trip to China, publicly advertised as a summer English teaching program. We were out to make disciples, as English teachers. Um, it's ironic but true to say that through a missions trip abroad, the Lord taught me that the well-known commandment to make disciples does not have to be abroad. There are people, even as we live our regular lives, so in need of the gospel. The Lord told me that he can even use, me, use my seemingly worldly career as an opportunity for ministry. I came back to start my sophomore year at Penn with a completely different mindset of my academics and future career. Even in the midst of discouraging grades, the Lord has continually told me that I should be doing all of this for His kingdom. Um, even, even in my darkest days, um, I should not give up hope, for the Lord is with me. The love and support of the GCC community has shown me even more of the Lord's favor and goodness. Now as I'm interacting with peers or volunteering, I cannot help but to see the Lord's love on each precious person and notice my deepened compassion for people in need of the Lord's love. Through these four years of college, I have suffered greatly, but the Lord has proved himself faithful. What an almighty, wondrous, and living God who rescued me from my stubbornness and nearsightedness of worldly aspirations. The Lord's steadfast character is so evident when I am reminded to keep the Lord at the center of my life and praise him with every breath that I breathe. Matthew 6.33 has confirmed to me that as I continue on in my career path, I am to seek first his kingdom and his righteousness, and all these things will be given as well. Thank mm -hmm. you.